Welcome guys back to another video. Here we go, episode number three, Capital One MasterCard. And I wanna quickly say, sorry about in the last video, if I ever said MasterCard or Capital One because I was doing this card next from my Discover video and I kept saying MasterCard or Capital One. And some of you guys were like, um, dude, your numbers are showing all that type of stuff. But guess what, I don't care because this card is not even relevant anymore, it's trash. Um, like I, I changed this to a new product and also have all new numbers, expirations and everything like that. Anyways, for this card, for the sign up um, offer that they make is, so basically if you make on time payments um, on your bill for five months straight, they'll raise your credit limit without even a hard inquiry or nothing. So you just apply, right when you get this card, pay your bill five months, on time the whole thing doesn't matter they'll like okay this dude shows good payments so let's help him out let's give him a credit increase um when i had it they increased mine double so i had a 500 at first and then they increased it to a thousand um sometimes people start off with a thousand and then they'll go to like four thousand but my credit wasn't that great so they only did it by 500 this has a 0% annual fee. This earns no points, no cash back, nothing. That's why this card was changed to my Quicksilver card. Capital One has one of the best credit monitoring systems out there from any app, any company. And I really love it and that's one of the main reasons that it's good to have this. Even though you can actually get credit wise without even having their um, thing, but it's all like within the sign up thing, so it's a lot better that way. Um, this has fraud protection, extended warranty, auto rental insurance, um, 24 hour travel assistance, which if you were to lose your card, um, they'll give you a new card and some cash in advance, which is pretty cool, um, you know, just in case you lose it. But let me say, I lost my wallet, so I lost this card too. Um, and the cash in advance it was a pain in the butt and getting this card wasn't as easy as discover like I had to wait a few days um, which is a good thing I was there for two weeks if I wasn't there I wouldn't have had them send it there I would just have them send it at the house and I'll get it back when I get there which is another thing why I like Samsung pay I just found out for some reason I've been I've had Samsung for over five years and I never noticed <laughs> that they had Samsung pay and if I did notice in the past, I just didn't remember. But anyways, back to the card. Now, um, there's no foreign transaction fees on any Capital One card. So if you get another card that's not Capital One, no matter what it is, there's no foreign transaction fees, which is pretty awesome. And then also you can get virtual card numbers through the webpage. So say if you wanted to buy something on Amazon or whatever, and you don't want your card number to be leaked, or stolen, they can give you virtual card numbers so that you can use that, which is awesome. But also, if you guys liked my last video and you like this video and you like this credit card series, don't forget to drop a like on this video. It really will help me a lot. Um, and if you really like the Discover It card and if you guys didn't watch that video yet, you can click um, on this link right here. I'll just start that at the end of the video. And uh, I'll have a referral link in this description for the, the Discover It card. And if you sign up using that link, you'll get $50. I'll get $50. Um, you know, if you get accepted within your first purchase, you like it could be a dollar, whatever, doesn't matter. Within like a few days, you'll get your $50. I'll get mine. So that's awesome, and that'll help me a lot, and I'll appreciate it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next credit card video. Peace. Thank you.